my channel today I am really excited about this one because it's my first I'd say official Christmas style video that I've ever done so um, yeah so do you know what I saw I think it was only a few days ago I saw the uh, the coca-cola Christmas advert come on the telly and it, I'm like it's, a, it's officially Christmas yeah, I don't think I can properly celebrate it until that advert comes on the telly. And then, yeah, then I start getting excited. I'm so sad. But yeah, so uh, I've got the new Christmas collection from She Glam by, by Shein. And it is, well, I haven't opened it yet. This will be a first impressions, but the pictures on the website look beautiful. So I'm hoping and praying that it does it does look as good as it does on the website. So right, without further ado, let's crack on. Right, okay, so first up, this isn't actually part of the Christmas collection, but I bought it because I haven't tried one of their eyebrow pencils yet. So this is the Skinny Brow Pencil. This one is in shade 3 Ash Brown. So looks like that. Standard Skinny Pencil, really, with a brush on one end and the twisty thing on the other end and then it's just like a standard kind of medium brown shade really oh oh nice nice little lines i have to say so i reckon we can get quite nice hair strokes out of that fingers crossed i don't know why i'm putting it back in the box so i'm going to use it in a minute but there's that then i also picked up this brush because I thought it just looked really nice very aesthetically pleasing <laughs> so yeah I'd like it when they come with these because when you wash your brushes if you put this back on it keeps it nicely in shape top tip so yeah it feels really nice and soft that actually feels like a really nice brush this oh I didn't tell you this one was I think I got 15% off site wide which i believe is still on at the moment it's like a black friday deal this was one pound 60 i think and this was only one pound 70 so i think these are only two pound normally anyway but it actually feels really nice and it's nice it's got quite a lot of fluff to it so yeah i thought i might try this as a blusher brush because i don't have a decent blusher brush Bl bl blusher you know what I mean so yeah there's that one then I don't know if to show you the palette or the lipsticks first now I'm going to show you the palette first so we've got the I can't remember what this is called a ruby queen instant look face palette so it's quite a nice size I love this iridescent sort of metallic -y red glow it's got to it and then it says She Glam Ruby, oh, it says Ruby Queen, oh my God, Ruby Queen on the front. God, I can't speak. So, right, okay. So we've got in, chuck that down there. So that's so pretty. I have to say, for the price that you pay for the, the She Glam makeup, they really do know how to do their packaging. It is just always so pretty and beautiful and really nice quality as well so this obviously in this it's like glittery I don't know if that's coming across on camera but it's like glittery silver writing on it ruby queen and these gorgeous snowflakes by the way do you like my little Christmas decoration I've got a gold snowflake B&M two quid so yeah and uh, I just think it's beautiful so inside nice we've got these colours here so obviously these are all shadows Do you know, let's take that off because you can't see it properly satisfaction so right 
So we've got these are obviously eyeshadow colours. There's quite a nice little selection there. They are very wintry shades, but that's fine by me because I like those anyway. And how many have we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven mattes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight shimmers. So there's those. And then we've got this one, which is a really icy, glittery highlighter. It's not really my cup of tea, that one, to be honest. And then we have this more champagne-y shade highlighter. And then we've got a couple of blushes here. That's really cute. That's actually printed onto the blush. And then two bronzers. And this, I think for full price, was only £7.50. But I only paid £6 something for it. £6.20, I think. So, yeah, bargain. Obviously, if they're decent. Last but not least, I have this lipstick collection, which I love. This was only £4.99 full price. And I got it for, no, it wasn't, that's a lie. I got it for £4.99, but it should have been 7 or £6.99. So, yeah, this would make a really nice Christmas present as well. So, we've got a little pulling bit here. And then we have these lipsticks inside, which are all this beautiful metallic red. I'm just loving this. And then you've got the S on the top. They look really expensive. And then, oh my days. Oh, these are, these are just beautiful. Can you see that? That's, at, no, you can't because I've got it too low. Look at that. That's actually in the lipstick. That is stunning. Absolutely stunning. I was not expecting that. I, on, on the website, they had stars on, but I don't know. I just thought it was for the picture. I didn't actually think they were going to be on there. Wow. That, that, is, that is beautiful. Nice colour as well. So this is obviously the first one I've picked up. Oh, this one's called Milk Tea. They've got the names on the bottom. So I'm going to swatch them. So. Got a bit of shimmer. They're kind of like shimmer matte. So that's that one. That's actually a really nice nude. And then, oh, this colour's lovely. This one's called Peony. So that's that one. Oh, why do I keep holding it too low? That's that one. And if we swatch this one as well. That's like a really nice berry. So obviously this one. It's a really nice berry shade. Oh, that's bright. It's quite a nice kind of cerise pink on that one. Oh, that's bright. I don't know. That might be more of a summer shade for me. I mean, you could wear it winter. It's up to you, really, isn't it? Sorry if I keep wobbling you. Yeah, I've got them on the table. Oh, really like this colour. So, and we've got that one, which is a really nice deep red. At least that's how it looks, anyway. That's how it swatches. Yeah, that's lovely. So, that's that one. Nice, nice, really, really impressed with those. Right, so uh, I suppose we better try them out. Right, so I'm going to start off with my brows. So I'm just going to quickly fluff them up a bit with the Benefit 24 hour brow set. So I'm just going to pop that on first. Right, then I'm going to go in with the eyebrow pencil, so wrong end, see what this is like. I'm loving how skinny that is on the end, that was really easy to do those hair strokes at the front of my brow. Hmm, nice. Right, so yeah. I'm, I'm really liking them. Oh, that's a, that's a really nice pencil. 
for £1.60 or whatever it was. That's an absolute bargain. Right, so next up I'm going to go in with this beautiful palette. So we're going to do the eyes. I've already prepped up. By the way, I have put my base on except for these, these bits. Um, I use the Misha BB Cream, which I'm still loving. And uh, just a little bit of concealer. I just use the Maybelline Anti-Age can see that and I have a really itchy eyebrow yeah so right I'm gonna go in with the eyeshadow I did a plummy look on my last video but to be honest looking at the colors so these let me get them in focus these are the, the all the shadow colors and I think I think I might mix it in with this kind of orangey coppery shade which looks a lot different to on camera to what it does actually in real life um but yeah i think i'm gonna just yeah do whatever let's just go for it right okay so first of all in my crease i'm gonna go in with this shade here which is kind of like just a standard transition shade they do have names but it's on one of those sheets which i'm not a fan of if i'm honest it's called glory so I'm just going to go in. this is clean, it's just stained. Okay, so you can't really see it's the stained brush, but I'm going to go into my crease with that one anyway. Like that. It's actually really quite pigmented. Right, so I'm just going to blend that. Okay, I don't want to speak too soon. Right, then just above that one, I'm going to go in with that, whoops, that one I said about, this one, top middle, just called Gift. God, these have got some pigment on them. Then I'm just going to use a clean fluffy brush just to, to blend that. so nice right okay then on my outer corner here I'm gonna take this shade here which is kind of like a dark I'd almost say like a maroon shade like a purpley brown oh that's nice really really like that color right then i think what i'm actually going to do is just cut that in a crease slightly i'm just using mattes at the moment and uh, i'm going to go in with that brighter purpley shade so i'm just going to go and cut the crease and then i'll be back so i made a bit of a boo-boo and um forgot to press record when i did this one so what i've done is i've done the other eye and caught up to the same point that i was at and then uh, we'll finish this one so that was my cat um so then this color here i'm gonna put on the where i've cut the crease All right so what i'm just gonna do now is just wear that's gone a little bit messy where I've cut the crease there. I'm just going to neaten that up, just neaten up these edges and uh, yeah, I'll be back. Okay, so next what I'm going to do is just go underneath. So for the underneath, I'm just going to take that kind of coppery orangey shade again. So this one, and I'm just going to take that back underneath. Right, and then on the inner corners, I'm actually going to go in with this one here, which is more like a rose gold. That's actually a really nice colour. This one's more of a pressed pigment. It's more like, you know, and it's quite spongy. 
Right, underneath my brow bone, I'm going to go in with this corner one, which is a bit like a, it's a bit similar to that highlighter shade, to be honest. So I'm just going to take some of that and go underneath. Yeah, that's lovely. I might just add a little bit of that on that inner corner shade as well. Yeah. Pretty. Right, okay. So that's eyes pretty much done. I'm just gonna go and pop some mascara on. So eyes are done, so we need to do the base now. So I'm gonna go in with bronzer first. Um, obviously we've got these two. So what I think, so I think I'm gonna go in with the darker one. I'm just gonna chance here, but just try not to. Um, yeah, try not to take quite so much on my brush. Right. That's actually really, that's actually really quite a nice bronzer. It's a shame it's only a small pan. You kind of have to sweep your brush like that through it, if you know what I mean. Um, but I'm actually really liking how that looks on my skin. Right, okay. Oh, exciting. Now I'm going to try this little bad boy out with the blush. So we've got two blushes here. So we've got this one, which looks like it might be. Oh God, I'm running out of room. Yeah. Oh. So, see, look, that's obviously like got the highlighter on top. So you kind of have to, oh, look at that color. Oh, you can't see it. Can you see that? That'd be nice on eyes, Just a shame. It's kind of like a, a frosting on top of it. Uh, okay, I'm going to go in with this one here, which I've just noticed it's got like a, you see that, it's got like a gradient. It's quite cool. I'm going to take a little bit of this. A bit more pinkier than I'd normally go for, but might be all right. I actually really like that looks pinkier when you swatch it but when you have it on it's actually quite natural looking I'm really happy with this look so far right and then highlighter so we're going to go with the champagne one so this one here oh I like that That's really nice. I really like that. Right, okay, so I'm just gonna do the rest of my face with it as well. I'm loving how my skin's looking. I'm gonna say it now because I have used everything. What an amazing palette. For six pounds something that I paid for it, even if you pay full price at 7.50, that is a blooming bargain. That is, honestly, I've tried so many Shein palettes. I've tried the ones that look like the Colourpop ones and they're really good, apart from the pastels, but then pastels are like that anyway. But this one, honestly, is just so good. Right, okay. I'm gobsmacked. I didn't want to say anything too soon because obviously I hadn't tried everything in there, but now I have. Wow. Wow. My skin looks really nice. The eyeshadow looks really nice. They're really pigmented. They're really easy to blend. 
This eye, by the way, ignore this here. So pay more attention to this one. I've um, woken up with a bit of a cold this morning and whenever I get a cold, I don't know what it is, this eye always waters a lot. So that's all that is, is where my eye keeps watering and I keep trying to clean it up, but yeah. I'm just gonna wait till the end now and do it again because I've done it about three times now. But obviously where the water mixes with the eyeshadow, it's just done that. But... Celebi. Right, so lips. So I think, bearing in mind, I've got this kind of berry color on my lids. I think I'm gonna go for the berry lips as well. Make a change from a nude. I'll just find which one it was now. I just think was that one yeah right okay so I'm just gonna line my lips I didn't didn't have um, a lip liner so this is just an old Kylie one so I'm just gonna line my lips with this because it's kind of like a berry color okay and then let's try out this lipstick still can't get over them wow right That's such a nice colour. Yeah, the glitter doesn't come off. It's obviously just, I don't know how. It's quite amazing actually, but um, yeah. That colour's stunning, absolutely stunning. Really, really like that. Right, okay, so I'm just gonna sort this out and um, pop a bit of setting spray on and then I'll be back again. So there we go, there's the finished look. Um, yeah, really happy, really happy. I I cannot get over how good that eyeshadow well face palette was for the money. Honestly, I am gobsmacked, absolutely gobsmacked. The shadows were lovely. The the bronzer was surprisingly good. The blusher was actually a really nice shade when it was on my skin and the highlighter is really nice as well. And the lipstick so good. That matches that purple perfectly really really pleased with it yeah big thumbs up so i'll just give you a quick close-up of the eyes i will say ignore this eye because i've struggled with this watering and i don't know what's going on just have to yeah what you see is what you get So I hope you enjoyed watching. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and ding the bell for future notifications. I usually upload on a Monday, Wednesday and a Friday at around 6pm, give or take. So I hope to see you there. Thanks for watching. Bye.